What's up, YouTube? Same ish, different day. This is your man, Skills on the Sticks, and today I'm coming with, at you guys with no skill, no problem, episode number two. And this is not a series, but it's just another class setup that I have for free for all that is basically going to enable you to be able to get a lot of kills very easily with basically no gun skill whatsoever. So let me go over the class with you guys so that you guys may further your intelligence and skill at this game. Now what we're going to go with is the Vepper and just a little bit of background on the gun itself. Um, I was watching a video from Drifter and um, he was saying that the Vepper when you shoot with it has the fastest uh, fire time when you're coming out of sprint. So that means from sprinting to shooting this gun shoots the fastest um, or has the reaction to shoot the fastest not exactly the fire rate um, but it has the reaction to shoot the fastest even faster than the CBJ so that is very important and that is the reason why we ran with it today and so uh, we ran with the Vepper with muzzle break and and rapid fire and you're gonna see me shoot from the hip a lot because when I play free for all, you know, I'm within close quarters. Now this class setup isn't exactly for team game modes because the Vepper it does not have a three shot kill range that is close. Um, I think it might even have a, only a slightly larger than the CBJ's three shot kill range. So it's definitely not a good for good for team mode um, game game types. So I definitely recommend only playing with this kind of setup on free for all um, if you are lucky enough or should I say good enough to even have success with it in team game modes you know hats off to you but this is I found this most beneficial when I was playing free for all um, only so the setup as you guys can see it was you can go ahead and pause it but ready up and quick draw that's just to help the gun get the shots off faster in case you need to aim if it's further um, this gun unfortunately has the slowest ADS time of any submachine gun so that is one thing to be aware of so if you do see someone please try to hit fire them if you can um, only aim down sights if you think it's super necessary uh, me I had a little bit of a uh, a little bit of like a habit in aiming down the sights but if you can avoid that and you know they're close enough then definitely go for you know the hip fire so quick draw ready up dead silence amplify and focus and the reason why you have amplify here is because you want to get close range to people so when you have amplify you're able to hear people where they're at and then you can go ahead and get you know inch forward to them again having a headset is super crucial to this gameplay so make sure that you are having a headset uh, when you do this so with those perks, um, there's no specific reason why I had a, a tactical, I mean not a tactical insertion, a trophy, a trophy system. The reason why I had a trophy system was in case I got close to a cam and I started to kind of hang out in one spot more than another, I would put the trophy system up to um, kind of block any incoming projectiles, but that ended up backfiring on me once. So make sure if you do run trophy system and you are close to a cam or close to one of your kill streaks, don't stand right next to your uh, your trophy system because if somebody throws something at you, it's gonna it's gonna explode and it and it will kill you. So I learned that the hard way. So don't be like me and definitely don't do that. Uh, so what you do is when I when I ran specialists, you don't have to run specialists if you want to just go for kill streaks. Um, like I said, the fastest way to even win free for all is with kill streaks. You know, like maybe U UAV dog and. Uh, chopper uh, chopper or helicopter whatever you want to run uh, so this is not you don't have to run this also the, the gun is pretty decent with hip fire without these specialist uh, perks but if you want to run you know go for a cam strike or whatever then you would do it like this uh, the first perk is going to be steady aim at three kills of course scavenger at six and then sleight of hand at nine and your bonus at 11 kills will be resilience marathon and dead eye uh, i didn't feel like i needed to put marathon in my um ordinary perk i mean my stock perks original perks because i just felt that i could use amplify to kind of inch towards my enemy since there's a lot of buildings and cover for you to utilize on this map so hopefully you guys try this out again no skill no problem that's exactly what i felt like i was doing here um i will be uploading more videos soon i'm gonna upload um how to chem strike like an easy way you know an easier way to get chems uh, i'm gonna do a lot more class setup videos 
and uh, I'm gonna do even uh, since the new maps are out now. Well, not new maps, but I didn't know that they were gonna let, enable me to play free for all on these maps. I'm gonna do a how to play free for all on all these maps, so you guys stay tuned for that. And thank you guys again for watching. Please like and give this video a thumbs up, and please do subscribe if you haven't already. I definitely appreciate that. And we're gonna have a giveaway coming up this Wednesday, so make sure you're subscribed to me here and following me on Instagram at Skills on the Sticks in order to be entered. Thank you guys for watching. I'm Skills on the Sticks, and I'm off.